As you already know, now you can generate amazing realistic looking AI images using Gemini or ChatGPT. But there is one big problem. When you zoom in the picture, it's blurry and grainy. That's why it's not very useful for professional and commercial uses. But in today's video, I'm gonna show you the tool that will exactly fix that. Let me introduce you to AI RT Image Enhancer, one of the best tools I have ever used for enhancing images. Now let's open the AI RT Image Enhancer. You can download it for free, the link is in the description below. This is the main interface, on the right you've got all the settings and you can upload your image just by clicking this button. I'm going to import all these pictures at once. Ok here's the photo of the burger. It looks great at first but when you zoom in all the details are gone. It's blurry and noisy. Let me show you how to fix that. First let's select the hardware. I'm choosing my GPU for faster processing. In the AI model section, you'll see different options for different types of enhancement. I'm picking the more details GAN V3 model. Next I'll set the upscale to 8K resolution. Leave everything else as default then just click start. Wait a few seconds and boom, look at that. On the left is the original and on the right is the enhanced version. See how the bone texture, CSM seats and grill marks pop back into focus. The blur and noise are gone and every detail looks clean and realistic again. That's the AI model bringing back all the lost details beautifully. Now I have this image that I generated using Gemini. At first glance, it looks amazing. The lighting, the colors, everything seems perfect. But when you zoom in, you'll notice the real problem. It's full of grain, blurry, and bit pixelated. That's something almost every AI generated image struggles with. Let's fix that. I'm again selecting the more detailed GA on V3 model, keeping all the other settings at default, and clicking the start button. And done, look at that, all the noise is gone, the edges are sharper and the textures are back. The image now looks super clean and detailed without losing its natural look. Now let's talk about another use case. I've got this photo and honestly it looks fine at first, nothing really wrong with it. But when you zoom in super close, you'll start seeing those tiny grains and weird little artifacts that just ruin the clean look. So here is what I'm gonna do. I'm selecting the real photo v3 model, setting the upscale to 2x, then turning on 2 pass processing and choosing the more detailed GA on v3 for the second pass. Now just hit start and wait a few seconds. Alright, check this out. Before you could see all those tiny noise patches and artifacts everywhere, but now they are completely gone. The texture looks natural, edges are clean and the whole image just looks sharper and more polished without that fake over sharpened look. And that's the best part, it fixes the small flaws that you usually don't notice until you zoom in. Now let's talk about another amazing feature, I've got this super low quality picture, it's almost impossible to recover but let's see how far we can push it. For this one I'm going to use the more detailed GA on V3 model, upscale it to 2x then turn off 2 pass processing. Now here's the main part, enable face restoration and select gradient overlay. Once that's done, just hit start. And there you go, it's fixed. I mean it's not perfect but look at the difference. For an image that had almost no detail at all, this is actually a huge recovery. The face looks clear, the colors are balanced and the overall image is finally usable. That's what makes this feature so impressive. Even with the worst quality photos, it still managed to bring back life. Now let's recover this AI generated photo. I'm using the AI GC Smooth V3 model for this image. And as you can see, it looks pretty good now. Next I have this anime picture. I'm using Smooth Diff V2 model and check out the result clean and really impressive. Then I have a nice city photo and I wanted to print, but it's full of noise. Let's fix it. I'm using the real photo v3 model and boom, it's clean, sharp and ready for printing. If you want to export it, just go to export settings, 
adjust the format, DPI and quality, then click single export. Now it's ready to print. Now here is the main feature. If you have a lots of images to fix at once, just upload them all together. Select your model. Go to export settings and choose format, DPI and quality. Pick your output folder and click to batch export. All your images will be fixed and saved automatically. Super fast and easy. A new update just dropped today and I could not resist trying it out. So let me show you the new strength and color adjustment feature. First I'll go to the AI model and select more detailed GA on V3. Let's upscale it to 8x, turn on 2 pass processing and select more detailed GA on V3 again. For strength, I'll reduce it a bit, I don't want it too strong or it will look unrealistic. Then click start processing and just like that, all the details are back and with the adjusted strength, it looks perfect. Next, let's move to color adjustment. Click to enable it. Then increase temperature and tint. I'll also boost contrast and saturation. Reduce highlights, increase shadows and lower whites and blacks. Now check out the before and after. It looks amazing now. And that's it, blurry, low resolution or grainy, AI RT image enhancer fixes it all. Just pick your model, click start and watch your images come to life. If you want to try it for free, link is in the description of this video. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.